No, no, losing. I still got him. I just came out for a walk this morning. I usually will do that, you know, if the weather's nice before work. I used to walk a, a mile or so, just get a little exercise, and I always bring a rod with me just in case I, I see something breaking the water. There's definitely a lot of activity going on out here. what we got. Imagine this is going to be a lady. It's not jumping. Spanish. Like that. Heck yeah. I bet you. Oh, goodness. Get me all wet, dude. <laughs> Thanks, dude. All right, I'm sure I got water all over the lens. Let's see if we can catch some more of those. I moved down the beach a little bit. I see him jumping over here now. Missed that one. There's another one. <laughs> Oh, there's a big out there, Jack Cavell right there. Oh, there's big Jack. All right, buddy. Thanks, dude. All right. Another one. Man, they are thick right here. I wasn't planning on keeping fish, but I might end up taking a couple of these home. There's a ton of activity in the water this morning. It's insane. I can see sharks swimming by, Spanish, dolphins, Jack and Bell. Just crazy. Just using this uh, this spoon. Uh, it's like a last last cast tackle. I think I got it on Amazon. I think it's actually been sitting in my tackle box for years. And I just grabbed it. Figured I'd bring it out. Using a 10 foot uh, Berry Pro Ocean Master with a Shimano Stratic 5000. I think this is a I think it's 15 pound braid. Definitely schools of Spanish out here. These uh, porpoises got to be feeding on the Spanish.
He's a little nice one there. Heck yeah. I think I might hang on to this guy. I have lost him. His battery's real small. He's a little guy. There, dude. That's a little guy. Yeah, the porpoise are coming in, feeding on. I'd like to get one more decent one. I kept that, that one big finish. I'd like to have at least two. I always, always hate uh, cleaning one fish. So maybe this guy will be good size. Definitely putting up a little, little more stink about coming to the beach. Yeah, he's all right. Perfect. More beach groceries. If anybody wants to know where we got our name, well, there you go. Beach groceries. Actually, battling the dolphin or, or the porpoise, battling the porpoise for the Spanish mackerel right now. That porpoise is super, super shallow. He's putting on a show down there for the for the beach goers. Pretty cool. Morning. I think uh, the porpoise took my yeah he took my fish. <laughs> There's fish blowing up everywhere right here, and I don't have a jig on. <laughs> that porpoise totally came up and took my hooked fish. They're, they have incredibly good eyesight. So when I used to fish on the pier a lot, they would do that. They would come up and take your bait, but they're, they can see the hooks. So they never bite that part of the, the fish. You rarely ever see a porpoise ever get hooked. They're extremely smart. All right, all I had was uh, this X-Wrap long cast. I'm not sure how well it's gonna do, but that's all I got, so see what happens. Oh, lost him. 
this uh this x wrap only has single single hooks on it not treble hooks so that's gonna definitely affect the fish staying on there and here comes flipper again messing up my fishing <laughs> he's coming in hot Is he going? He's going that way. I'll stay over here. Now he's coming over here by me. There we go. Let's see if we can keep this one. Definitely not a going after the X wrap as much as the spoon. Oh, we lost it. Yeah. Yeah, I prefer to use single hook rigs like, or lures like this, just because it's easier on the fish. You know, especially if you're letting them go. They, the treble hooks can really tear their mouth up. But unfortunately, you lose more fish. Spanish, Spanish mackerel. Yeah. I'm gonna try to toss this guy in. Don't want the hook to pull on. Yeah. Man, the water is just a beautiful color right now. Emerald green. It's awesome. I don't even have some my glasses on. He hit it up close. On the X-Wrap. All right, buddy, I'm gonna let you go. Thanks, dude. Shout for Flipper. No way. Man, all right, that was fun. Quick little trip to the beach uh, just to get some exercise and uh, got to catch some fish, man. I tell you what, that was unexpected. But I was out there for uh, about an hour and caught like 12, 13 fish, something like that. But yeah, I'm keeping four. Take that any day. Anyway, thanks for watching. Make sure you like.